about the stadium. Yo, 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 yo. We back once again with the True Hip Hop Podcast. It's your boy, DJ Blaze. And that guy again. Wolverine. We back for episode 95. 95. Live. Live and exclusive. Yo, but before we get started, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Right now. Like, comment, and share. Right now. Now that helps us out tremendously on the algorithm. Me and Wolf appreciate all the love y'all been giving us, but y'all ain't been subscribing, so hit that bell. Bing, yo, make Corn. sure it's all notifications too. You heard? Definitely, definitely get, get it exclusive. But we finna dive right into this hot context, man. Yesterday, 50 Cent was in DX Magazine. You know, it says 50 is slowly making his way into the sports world, according to NBA.com. The Queen's entrepreneur and his premier wine and spirits company have signed a multi-million dollar partnership with the Houston Rockets in their home venue, the Toyota Center. As a part of the agreement, 50's Bronson Cognac brands will be highlighted during home games and other events at the entertainment center with multiple theme bars branded luxury suites and a courtside logo box. The red and white wine Bristol within the venue will also be renamed the Sir Spirits Bar and Restaurants. And the rapper will be given access to suites and courtside boxes all year long. You know what I'm saying? So how long was the contract, just one year? Uh, they didn't say how many years it was, but it's a multi-million dollar deal. Yeah. They didn't say how long the term was, but it's a good look, man. It definitely is multi-million. Yeah, I like how 50 be making these moves, man. Mm -hmm. He gonna make sure his business is straight. And that's what these rappers need to make like their blueprint off of 50. Because his yeah. name is the brand. Right. It's not the label. It's His name is the brand. Mm -hmm. He made his name solidify everything that the Damn. label was supposed to be carrying so he don't need the label right because it's his name yeah he traveled he, he got his own company his own everything brand, with 50 his yeah. own liquor you say 50, his own shoes his own world, tv everything you say 50 around the world <laughs> is not g unit they don't right. even associate him with g you know or right. any label anymore right it's just him. As it's a just business, 50 man. as a business, as the brand of everything. He was so smart on that, man. Yeah. Like, I'm not going to promote my label. Right. I'm going to promote me on everything. Right. Myself. Myself. So, therefore. That's the true meaning of independence. That's the true of you know what I'm That's what these man. rappers need to look at 50 and be like, damn, he doing this and doing that. All Let going me to follow him. the model, B. You know what I'm saying? Let me do this. And all 100% revenue to me, to my company. To him and you know what I'm saying? That's why he was so, so smart with that, you know? They ain't having Jimmy Iveen backing him up. Right. You know what I'm saying? He got nobody backing him up. He used the I money mean, he made to promote himself and build his brand. And they sponsor him. They come to 50. Yeah. They come to <laughs> they 50. They ain't coming to the record label. No, they're going to 50. He's getting generated. Because if he was that. signed to Interscope still, they'll go to Jimmy Iveen. We'll give 50. 10%. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Jimmy making 80. all that money. Nah, <laughs> right, nah, nah. We cutting that out right now. Go ahead, cut out the fact, middle give me all the bread. All the bread. And then I will dispense the bread to who I feel like needed. Right. You know, but I don't need you to dispense me part of my money that I, the brand that I made. Yeah. Nah, you know, that's, you know, you gotta buy, not only just buying your masters, man, you make sure you get out of contract so therefore you can be that brand. Yeah, like and like, that's what the thing with the liquor, that's his liquor. He's right. not supporting Hennessy. Right. You know what I'm saying? Or any uh, Duce or any other company. Which, which Jay Z promotes have his own liquor. Yeah, he got his own liquor too. Everybody having their own, not going to yeah. eliminate the, the middlemen. Them, them people, those are middlemen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The label and they, made, the and they really making money off the artist, and the artists do all the work. Do all the Since work. Since I'm doing all the work, I need all the, the money. Agents. You know what I'm yeah. saying? But you know what? Our agent makes more money than a lot of ball players. Yeah, because they got so many million dollar contracts on the floor. Man, not only that, he's just like, you know, but this he get 10% out of his contract. That's a lot of money saying, and not do no work. This whole segment is like 
showing how to build your brand as an artist. That's what we want y'all artists to know. And this, this is a great example with 50. Great example. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Showing y'all, we talk about 50 every week about how he add inventions, leaving somewhere, one door open, another one, one door closed, another one opens. Right. Y'all comment below, man. Let us know what y'all think about 50 with the Toyota Center and the Houston Rockets deal. You know what I'm saying? I think it's a good look, man. It's, it's a good look to me. It's doing a look. The thing. Off the top. All right, man. We got to move on, man. Yesterday in the Source magazine, they had the competition between Beanie Siegel and Scarface. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And we trying to see who do y'all think is the better artist. I went with Beans, man, because I just like how he snapped on tracks, his voice, his state property movement, you know what I'm saying, holding it down, man. I thought he was the better MC, but Wolverine thinks different. No, I think different, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know I think different. For one, I'm going with Scarface because... He solidified. I mean, the man is the man is a good artist. He's a great artist, man. For all the stuff that he wrote, when he can take his versatility from north, south, east to west, and rock with all the good artists and still maintain and making them good tracks, Beanie did. Beanie is a great artist, without a doubt. I love. Man, I feel that Beanie is gonna have bully. way better songs, man. Nah, like feel it in the air, rock nah. the mic, feel it it's in the air. on. You know what I'm saying? Man. And he killed the Scarface on. No, uh, never seen a man cry back. till I seen a man die. Yeah, man, but and, I don't feel that Scarface. And, 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 and then all, all the, the tracks. How y'all try to make Scarface is like he just was had banging after banging. He man. had bangers after bangers. He wasn't bangers. on Jay Z and pocking them level, man. Yes, he was, no, bro. He, not, man. he was, bro. He, he was, was just a little older. Level. Yes, he was. Nah, they bro. all the same age, man. But he was out before Jay Z, though. No. Man, he was on the mainstream before Jay Z, though. No. They still the Ghetto same. Boys was Jay -Z out made before way Jay -Z. better music and Beanie man. To I mean, me. uh, they Jay Z no made better uh, business moves. Just like I'm gonna say this, Jay Z made better business moves than Scarface. Scarface made better moves than Benny Single. Now, as far as lyrics, oh. huh? Benny Single had his movies. Scarface ain't have no movies. Scarface got a lot. Beanie had two movies, man. He had his own state property line, state property clothing. Scarface ain't never had no clothing line. He may not have no Beanie clothing line. Beanie was way better with the business. No, no Beanie. Way better. How can you not say that? How can you say that? He had a clothing line and a movie company. That wasn't, that Scarface clothing didn't line, have man, nothing. no. Man, that no. state property was popping for at least five years, man. State property was popping for Scar like Race one didn't or even two. have a clothing line. That don't necessarily mean that all the business. <laughs> what did he the have? Clothing, clothing. He was still signed hold to on, a, bro. Hold a on, label. Bro. Hold on. They he both still was signed to a they label. They both were signed to no, a label. No, Dave, Dave gave him state property, let him be independent, bro. He didn't do nothing with state property. Yes, he did. He made two movies and he made and the state crumbled. property chain gang album. He, he had three albums under it. As what you even know, face, dude, he was tied to a label for man, all bro. his life and never made no money, bro. He made man, no money off of Nick. He didn't want to make, make no, no money. Man, Beanie was a millionaire, man. Everybody on Rockefeller was a millionaire. Even Memphis Bleak, Pity Crack, they made millions, Young Guns, they, they all were millionaires, they all made, bro. Scarface didn't really become a millionaire Scarface like that, man. A millionaire. Scarface yeah. made a millionaire. He made yeah. millions, bro. Off of what? Right. Off his albums, bro. Man, hell no. Nah. Now you better do the research <laughs> or you just, just confidently saying no. You better nah, do, you better man. check on not like Not like Beanie did. Yeah, Beanie only made two some two albums. No, he made four. He made four albums. Man, only two real solid albums that went to What solid album did Scarface have? Man, Mr. Besides Scarface the fix. That's it. All man, all the Scarface tracks know they hey, got, man, he man. was so bet more singles. All no. that, bro. Hey, Are you so. really competing? <laughs> no. Scarface to Beanie Singing. No. I like Beanie. But Beanie ain't be wasn't Beanie better, better than Scarface, man. He ain't had better songs. Man, he had a lot or of better, better songs. Voice. I mean, or yeah, better voice. Yeah. Oh, and voice and delivery? Yeah. Come on, man. Scarface more than that. Who's back, man. That's that one track. It, one track, but you that's from a perspective from somebody from the east. But if you say, say ask somebody Beans, from Beans the south, better, you know what I'm saying? Nah, he had Beans Kanye West. Better. Kanye nah. West produced most nah, of the BBC nah, stuff, man. man. And the, Scarface the old had better, Kanye West. Scarface had better Look, features, I had a better crazy, albums, man. he had better features. All man, that, bro. Was terrible, he rocked man. with from east, like I said, he rocked from <laughs> north, south, 
East yeah, to West, not all though. Like that, man, man, that was hit. Yeah, I, I, was block. I give him my block. Man, smile. and 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 uh, you know what I'm saying? and and, and uh, 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 my 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 train train tricks on me. I give him that. You know what I'm saying? It's a whole list. It's all. It got all. You said five songs. Beanie got like about seven, eight songs out of out of those four yeah, albums. Well, that's better than five. No, Scarface <laughs> got like about twenty-five good tr- good yeah. tracks. About yeah, we I'll... went through the list earlier. I already uh, <laughs> went over twenty-five of them that was banging. Yeah, man, I like I like Beans much better. All right, and I like Scarface better. But, but I know I, mean... I know because when it was in the group, a lot of people like Scarface, but I just don't see it. I like I don't, man. That's just me as a musician. Uh, and that's just me yeah. as a musician like, I that just, I feel like Scarface produce, produce better work, better I quality work, it, man. man. I, I feel like I just only think, reason why you like that because like, okay, Kanye West did uh, the beans. beans. He did his beats. So now that's why you said, oh, he made better beats. But Scarface had various. And he had a better movement. Scarface had a better Beans yeah. had a way better movement no, by he himself. Didn't. No, he, he didn't. branched off from the rock and did his state property shit. Nah. When he, when Scarface nah, broke off from Ghetto Boys, nah. what did he really do? He like, did all the solo albums by but himself. He, movement, he did like man. another seven to ten solo yeah, albums yes, after he that. Did, but they was Benny all singles bigger. broke from the um from the rock. Well, with state property and did like two one album. <laughs> he did one album. He broke off. That's because he broke his lung, man. <laughs> oh, no, that's the only reason. He did. Uh, Scarface go went through kidney transplant. That's weapon. now, man. That Even before happened. he was nah, sick. That was recent. He was sick before. I don't know, man. He was sick before. I'm giving it to me. I'm giving it to Scarface. <laughs> Come on out of here. Go say he left uh, the rock and now he made it up. He made he, when he left the rock, he hit motherfucking state property because he got what sick, album? Man. What album? What album? Get out of he here. got shot and had to go to jail. That's one why. album. And then he what lost album? The what album? Compared to somebody doing like seven to ten of them. All right, man. Y'all comment below, man. Let us know who y'all got, man. Scarface or Beans, man. I got Beans. He got Face, man. It's two. They both two good artists. Face more. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, we got to move on, man. In the Double XL magazine, man, Snitch Snix 9 was in there, man. <laughs> and Wack 100 Damn. said, man, Snix 6 9 had called him, man. He said, he said, the guy is doing bad, bro. I had to send that ninja $20 for some gas. Man, that's why we was telling the people ain't really nothing we can do for you right now because the ninja is broke. Broke, broke. Broke, broke. It's fucking terrible, man. Man. On uh, Sunday, March 13th, the Double XL obtained court documents revealing 6 9 is involved in a civil lawsuit which stems from a 2018 robbery that he and Treyway was present for. The plaintiff are seeking $11.8 million in punitive damages, and Takashi has told the judge that he's broke right now. I'm struggling to make ends meet. 6 9 said in the paperwork, I do not know if I'll ever get the type of advance money I was paid before, and my career is stalled. And the court awarded... It's over. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He said, if I have to pay this money, my career is definitely over. It's been over. Without you having to pay the money, <laughs> you, you only made $75,000. <laughs> biggest... And out of was, that 43 million. Out of that 43 million, you made 75. Well, no, he made a total. What was it? 75,000? 75, 75, one year. 75,000. 12,000 and negative 13? No. It, it was, was something crazy yeah, like that. Tw- yeah, 75,000 and 12,000. And 20, 20 he had 75, 21 he had 12,000. And so he, he don't but he had, money. But he had, in 19, he had 1.9. Okay. That's, that that, that's when he got that advance. He got 1.9 in 19 and 20. He had 75,000. 70, he made 75,000 and 21. He had got he had uh 12,000. But the whole this 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 that's situ- telling you about them contracts. Man. But this situation, you know, um, the civilians are suing him for. They said they witnessed Treyway rob this bank or whatever they was robbing, but 6 9 wasn't a person robbing them. He was, he in, was the in the car. car recording it. And they didn't even see 6 9 well, They just the car with the guys who was robbing them. Yeah. It was a it was so, accessory to a robbery. So it's not even the people who got robbed that's suing. It's people who witnessed the robbery right. is suing him. 
<laughs> you know what I'm saying? Then we see, well, every time we turn around, we see somebody. <laughs> they say they, when they go to the bank, they have cold sweats withdrawing money. They can't sleep. You know, they got PSD from watching this robbery. You know what I'm saying? And they need 11 million, 5 million each. <laughs> you feel me? It's crazy, man. But yeah. they not going to win that, man. They not going to get Because they, 6 9 proved he's broke. <laughs> he proved he's broke. For one, he don't have ten million dollars. Right. For two, you're not even the person getting robbed. You just witnessed something. You know what I'm saying? I wish I could get paid for every time a motherfucker witness some bullshit. Yeah. Necessarily ain't gotta be no robbery. Just the stupidity <laughs> some people do. Yeah, that and was it, real stupid. That's like cutting you off in the highway now on 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 driving, and now I want to sue him. He cutting me off. Yeah, but I think that's crazy, man. But your career is over, 6ix9ine. You know, you're done for. You cannot use black culture. You're a culture vulture. You can't use this anymore to make no money and do the foolery that you've been doing. No one is feeling you. No one streams your music anymore. And no one is rocking with you. You rocking can't even go all. to the concert. You man. know? Man, so it's even over. as a guest, they ain't giving you no <laughs> guest pass and you're a star. <laughs> like, nah, man, you got to buy a ticket at the booth, too. <laughs> <laughs> you don't paint it to tattoo to face. No. You know, you can't even go get a real All that advance, all that jury, you didn't spend your, your advance. Oh, yeah. Um, the security company suing him for $3 million, too, because he had 24-hour security when he got out of prison. Mm. And he never paid them, so the security company left. That's WAC 100 security company, ain't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, ain't it? Ain't it? No. <laughs> he got them for them. Yeah, well, that's his company, though, ain't it? Because he know. said that he recruited some guys from, yeah. uh, from California to do the security for him. So I, I think it was it was through WAC 100. I think that was his security company. WAC was getting paid for that shit, man. Mm. No, he didn't get paid. He, nobody got paid yet because yeah, he's still suing got, it. Yeah. But I'm saying, WAC 100, I think that's WAC 100 uh, company, and that's what he was want. He wanted to put on blast, the fact that. No, nah, but it is a company, like, like they was off-duty cops that he had. You know what I'm saying? I think that's who we talking about, them off-duty cops that was doing the security mm -hmm. when he couldn't go in the house and they followed him to the store. So he had to get real cops. You know what I'm saying? That's why it's so much. You know? So... He ain't got no security no more. He ain't got no money. It's a wrap. Too bad, So, son. this is bad. This is bad. It's not good. Because now that everybody know he's snitch nine, and they know he ain't got that protection no more, yeah. people gonna want get a piece of him. I mean, they try to they kidnap him the first time. They may they ain't do it again. Man, because they, they mad about him. It's mad. Is a man still locked up right now? On, yeah, on his all them do, all okay, them locked so up. you... So you don't think they mad still? They, yeah. It's not about the money no more, bro. Yeah. It's not about money no more. They gonna get him when the time is right. This is the perfect time because <laughs> he got no security, no <laughs> nothing, got no money, no nothing. Mm -hmm. They they gonna think that he committed suicide. <laughs> You're right. You out of depression. Yeah. Y'all better keep an eye on on that boy. I'm telling you, heard it here first. True hip hop. Y'all comment below, man. Let us know about 6ix9ine being sued for $11 million to civilians who witnessed the crime. All right, we got to move on to the birthday shout outs. I want to give a big birthday shout out to Queen Latifah. Happy birthday, Queen. Happy birthday, Queen. Ladies, Ladies first. <laughs> <laughs> Reality. Shout out to Gumroom City, man. We out of here. One love. Peace. Peace. Mm-hmm.